Puerto of Lima. We did about 12 kilometers. And it seems we uh, we leave the city behind. It's still, uh, I think it's 20 k's before we reach the city limit. But uh, yeah, we're doing well. It's now 6.45. We did only 12, we did 12 kilometers. So that's nothing in one hour. There's a lot of traffic lights, a lot of speed bumps. Uh, also, the, uh, the quality of the road, it's a bit so-so. But uh, yeah, let's keep pushing. So I don't know if you can hear me or not. It's quite noisy here. But we're on the highway, on the toll road. We didn't pay toll because the motorbikes are free. We have to follow this for another 14 kilometers before we can go up. So fingers crossed. Everything is totally fine, you can do 100 here on the road, but people they seem to drive only 60, 70 km an hour, so that isn't too crazy. I have this big uh, emergency lane for myself, uh, and also I'm not the only cyclist on the road here. So we leave the busy highway uh, behind us and as soon as we left the highway we go on this dirt road looks like this the road is really shitty the view is incredible just uh, ride a little bit on this road we'll go for a small break drink some water uh, a little something then I have to make a decision I follow this road all the way to uh, to where I'm going that's another 35 or 40 k's um, so the maximum speed I can do here that's around 10 k because the road is so, sh so shitty I don't think I can do that the highway is right there so I might keep riding on the highway and sometimes you visit the village or so because this road is uh, it's too much maybe I have to lower my tire pressure a little bit because I'm riding with 6 bar so I'm flying on the highway but when you have a road like this it's so bumpy it's, oh, it's, uh, it's almost out of control oh, uh, right, breaky brake and safe. Shut up and sit down. Not sure why I'm riding this road when down there there's a better road actually. It's less busy. Not sure you can see it, but uh, it's a little bit on the right. Uh, so now I have to find a way to go to that road because it looks much better and it goes around the hills as well. Look at this village though, somehow it's beautiful. Next to the ocean, quite busy though. So a different road, less busy, much better, eh? Goes through the villages. So it's quite nice here.
must say it's a bit of a ride. It's also a bit of a climb. But we're almost there. 47 kilometers. And we're back in Asia. Kilometers. So this is what 24 euros buy you. It's called the Eco Lots. Not very impressive, is it? <laughs> 